Hello mga Karar! It's finally summer and if you're looking for an adventure near Manila that doesn't involve swimming or island hopping, then this vlog is for you. So guys, samahan nyo kami on our little adventure going to Mount Pinatubo. Hey everyone! So we're here at 5 Star Bus Terminal in Cubao and we are gonna be riding a bus going to Kapas Junction, Tarlac. So I'm gonna be traveling with Ace and of course Bench. And guys, cool thing about it is yung bus meron siyang CR sa loob. So it's not gonna be a problem if madalas kayo ma-CR during uh, travels. And malinas naman siya. So yeah, thumbs up. This is Luisa and welcome back to another travel vlog. So for today's vlog, we are here at Kapas uh, Tarlac. So this is not a beach trip, guys. So we're here. We're actually here for the Mount Pinatubo trek, but it was for tomorrow, pa. So we decided na pumunta na lang kami dito uh, before yung Pinatubo trek. Uh, for us to have time para at least to prepare for it and ayaw namin na mag-haul or magkaroon ng aberya sa biyahe papunta dito. Although, 1 hour and 30 minutes lang naman yung biyahe from Manila papunta dito sa may uh, Kapas Junction uh, Tarlac. So, hindi siya ganun uh, kalayo. So, from Manila, you just need to go to the 5-star bus station sa Cubao and from there, uh, Sakyan nyo yung bus na papuntang Tarlac. Nasabihin nyo na lang na bababa, bababa kayo sa May Kapas uh, Junction. For the fare, it's just 237 pesos per pack. So, uh, affordable naman siya. It's not that much. And from Kapas Junction, you need to ride a tricycle. And that's 400 pesos, guys. So, wag na kayo magtaka kung bakit ma masyado siyang mahal or it's a bit pricey compared to other uh, parang other areas, di ba, na manapuntahan na namin before. So, the reason is, medyo malayo siya. Actually, parang 30 minutes ride siya sa tricycle from Kapas papunta dito sa may accommodation na napili namin. So, we're here at Alvin and Angie, uh, I don't know, hindi ko masyado kabisado yung exact name ng uh, accommodation namin. Lagalagay ko na lang dito sa screen. So, it's 3,200 pesos for the three of us. So, it's just overnight uh, trip. So, dito na rin kami kumuha ng tour. And it's actually worth 6,000 uh, pesos. So, hindi naman na siya ganun ka-pricey. Kasama na doon yung 4x4 and all the entrance fees uh, for tomorrow. And guys, make sure to bring pala your government IDs kasi mayroong checkpoint uh, papunta dito sa may uh, accommodation. So, that's it for now. Of of course, we're gonna do a room tour or the property tour dito sa may accommodation na napili natin. So yeah guys, let's go. So it's Sunday pala guys, March 26. And it's currently uh, almost 3 in the afternoon. So ito yung uh, sa labas, uh, yung road sa labas ng accommodation namin. As you can see, grabe guys, sobrang init ngayon. So nasa 36 degrees na dito. Make sure to bring uh, sunglasses, sunscreen, or anything na panlaban natin sa init. So here is our accommodation. So Alvin and Angie Bognot, Mount Pinatubo Accommodation and Tour. So here's, uh, there's their phone numbers and the email address. So if you need to uh, contact them and inquire, then uh, do so. So here's the outside of their property. So madali lang naman siya makita from the road kasi may sign dito so let's go in so there ang ganda ang dami nilang halaman dito and in fairness I think sulit naman yung 3,200 kasi hindi tiniped uh, yung uh, itsura talaga dito sa accommodation um, nila so they have a lot of uh, rooms then so may cottage dito so you can make tambay ayan ang daming puno oh my god very uh, pro provincial feels Ayan. So, I think that's the space na pwede kayong um, kumain, mag-chill out, and there's bench. Nag-content din siya. Hi! Hello! Sungit pa! <laughs> Alright, so let's check the other area here. Okay, so ayan. Uh, chill spot as well. We have here some books though. So, if wala kayong magawa, you can actually read one of those books that they have here. And, yeah. Okay. 
And there's our room. So dito. So mamaya na tayo mag room tour, guys. It's so nice, actually. So super sulit. So they have shower areas here. Toilet. And that as well. Or as a mirror. That's me. Hello. <laughs> Hi! There's Vince, our caretaker. <laughs> so they also have a free Wi Fi here. And... So, hi guys! So, let's start the room tour here at Alvin and Angie Accommodations. Come here. Here's our room. And so, first thing first, so we have the bed. So, it's a double deck and it's on. I think this is a double bed as well. So yeah, actually, kasha dito yung anim no? Dalawa dito, two here, two here as well. So mayro free aircon. Ayan, may free talaga. May aircon siyang kasama. Other than that, may towels na rin. And a mini table here. So malabi din sa lang saksakan for your uh, gadget needs. And tada! <laughs> so guys, ito na yung... Um... So dito! <laughs> so guys, super love it. So guys, dito na kami sa may uh, CR area. So ito. So at least they have free tissues. Free tissues, I don't know. Of course, okay, nakaya natin may bidet, guys! So there's bidet, and yeah, super malaki talaga yung CR nila. So meron siya din po, shower na, may pail if you need it. So yeah. So, and that's basically it for the room tour, guys, dito sa may accommodation namin. So, I can say naman na sulit yung 3,200 na binayaran naman dito, which is actually good for three naman. So, yun, lalo na't may aircon siya kasi mas uh, kailangan namin siya dito kasi napakainit dito, guys. So, yun, uh, we're gonna update you later kung saan pa kami mapapadpad uh, dito kasi bukas pa naman yung trek namin sa mga pinadubo. So, see you guys later. Bye! Guys, so nandito pala yung owner ng uh, accommodation namin, si Mr. K, yung Alvin and Angie. So, hi po sa hi. vlog. Hello. Hello. Good afternoon. Hi, <laughs> let's pray. <laughs> pray for the drone. Yeah. So it's almost 5 in the afternoon. So maglalakad muna kami dito. Uh, for the sunset, hanapin namin yung uh, sunset uh, viewing area nila. And of course, paghahanap na rin kami ng kakainan kasi medyo uh, butok na kami. So ito yung road <laughs> dito. So guys, we're gonna update you later. Bye! Hi, doggo! Oh my god, there's a lot of doggos. Is this a cow? Here's their food. Burgers. Here's bench food. Burger with natural. So this is worth 100 pesos, guys. And here's our food. Here's mine. Burger steak. Ayan. This is worth 80 pesos. And kay Ace, ayan ang dami. I think more than 80 pesos na yan. So same, same food. And here's the mango shake. So let's eat. Golden hour, guys! So, guys, we're finally here at Sarab Valley. So, ayan. Ang ganda ng sunset! Oh my god! Let's explore the area. That is so nice. Oh my god, look at that view. Yes. Hello! 
ako sa Hello Vlog. Hi! Ano pangalan nyo? Rafael. Ra you're Rafael. Yung isa, sino siya? Duterte. Duterte? <laughs> si Rafael at si Duterte. here at Tita M's Food Hub. So, dito kami magda-dinner, guys. Here's our snack, guys, for dinner. So, pansit kanto na lang and tinapay kasi late na kasi kami nag-lunch ah, nag kanina. So, ito na lang before we sleep. Ayan, let's eat. Of course, masarap. Good morning guys! It's currently 4.47 in the morning and we woke up early so we can have our breakfast before our Mount Pinatubo trek. Here's the coffee and of course ham and egg for our uh, breakfast. Let's eat! And here's my OOTD for the Mount Pinatubo. This is our 4x4! Good morning guys! So update, it's already 6 in the morning and our first stop is here at Tobderon Hills! So ayan siya. So nag-stop over kami then mag-picture taking muna then after that we're gonna head to our next destination. So guys, we're gonna update you later. Bye! Update, nandito na kami sa may jump off area. So, yun. Mag-start na kami. Maglakad. So, see you guys there. <laughs> We're 2.5 km to the uh, crater. Hi guys, so tapalin tour guide namin si Kuya Alvin. 
So, <laughs> hi po. So, he's been doing this for 11 years na, Kuya, no? So, yun, kapasal mo, Kuya. Masaya naman. Ay, nice. 1.5 km to the crater. We're halfway there, guys. Oh, ah, look at the view. That is so nice. Hiya, pa. So, guys, we've been walking for 23 minutes now. Kaya pa naman. We're one km away to the Mount Pinatubo crater, and there's a toilet there, guys. Good morning, Kuya. Say hi to the vlog. Hi. So hi, guys. Update. So it's already eight in the morning. So we're finally here at the Mount Pinatubo a crater view deck. So ayan siya. I hope you guys can see it. So don't worry, magulang video na lang ako later. So ayan. I guess super worth it naman yung track dito. So almost one hour na lang yung track ngayon compared to a two hours na track ah before. So it's not gonna be ah that hard naman na. So yon. Enjoy the view! So for those who want to know, in June 15, 1991, so the historical eruption of the Mount Pinatubo happened. So it has been a dormant volcano for the past 400 years except na lang noong 1991. So which is considered as the second largest eruption for the uh, 20th century. So yeah, there. Oh my God! Let's go. Tignan yun naman, guys. Yen lang naman yung pababa. So yon. Kaya natin to. Let's go. Oh roar! Finally here at the water area or the beach area ng Mount Pinatubo or crater. So ayan, grabe. Ang ganda. Ang sabi ni Kuya, malalim na daw yan yung part na yan kasi parang butas siya. Kasi nga, di ba, parang um, sumabog tong uh, Mount Pinatubo uh, before. So, definitely, uh, they don't recommend na mag-swim uh, dito. Unless na lang, gusto, gusto mo na talaga siguro. So, there. So yun pala guys, once you're done taking photos or videos for your, of course, Instagram. So yun, make sure to take some time to appreciate the view then. No, padit, maganda dito magmuni-muni talaga. So yun lang, other than that, yeah, enjoy the view guys. And we'll update you later. Bye! A few moments later. Hi, Ish! So kamusta ang track natin? Is it worth it ba? Yung one hour track, yeah. It's definitely worth it, right? So, hindi naman ganun kahirap yung track pa punta dito, guys. So, sakto lang siya. So, kaya yung kaya niyo. Kinaya ko nga eh, di ba? So, 
Hi mga Karor! Update muna tayo. It's already 9.50 in the morning. So, pabalik na kami <laughs> doon sa may jump off area then 4x4 after. So, it's gonna be one hour uh, trek na naman. So, let's go! So guys, may bukal dito. So since wala kaming falls ngayon, dito na lang kami maliligo sa bukal na to. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Thank you. Hello, Makarol. So update muna. It's already 12 in the afternoon. So past 12 na. So yun, medyo nagsapover kami dito kasi there's a shooting range. Uh, ayun, so hindi kayo pwede magpa-pass through. So you really need to stop. So yun, naswertehan lang kasi kami talaga. So yeah, we're gonna wait. Sana hopefully mga 12.30 makalis na kami dito. So yeah. Waiting game pa rin! Hi guys, this is Ace. <laughs> Just vlog takeover. Um, update for today, we're still waiting here or stranded. Um, initially, they told us that it will take only one hour now. It's already two hours. We're thirsty and hungry at the same time. But still, we don't have to do anyway. <laughs> so, look at her. <laughs> Actually, it's here. she's still not moving or is she even breathing? <laughs> Yung her nyo. Guys, so, tingnan nyo. Pretty pa rin kahit tulog. <laughs> so, okay, maingay ah. Ano lang to, pinuha ko lang yung cellphone niya. Ingat! <laughs> So hi guys, update. So it's almost 3 p.m. na in the afternoon and we just got back here sa accommodation namin. So two and a half hours kaming nag-antay doon para matapos lang yung shooting range ng mga military kasi ya, yeah, ganun talaga guys. So make sure to adjust your itinerary kung mayroon man kayong pupuntahan after ng Mount Pinutubo trek, much as well adjust it talaga kasi uh, you'll never know kung meron silang shooting range and we can't do anything about it kasi syempre uh, lugar kasi nila yun so nakikidaan lang kasi tayo doon doon kasi yung daan ng papuntang Mount Penatubo at pabalik din then so once merong shooting range uh, haharami talaga tayo doon so yun guys um nakabalik na nga kami dito sa accommodation we're gonna find a place to eat kasi we're super hungry na then after nun pack up na rin kami and back to Manila so we're gonna update you guys later bye So hello guys, update is already 5 in the afternoon and pabalik pa lang kami ng Manila. So we're still here at the accommodation. accommodation. So yeah, we're just waiting for the tricycle uh, that will take us to Kapas Junction. Then after that, uh, magbabasta kami papuntang Manila. And guys, I'm going to end the uh, Mount Pinatubo uh, vlog na here. Kasi yes, wala na kaming energy uh, to vlog pabalik na din. Kasi gusto na lang namin magpahinga. So yun, I hope you guys like the video. Please do comment and share to this video. And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. So thank you so much guys for watching this video. And see you on the next one. Bye!